how to fix Valorant error code VAN68. Method 1. Reset TCP IP settings and flush DNS cache. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the run dialog box, type in CMD and hold down Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter keys to open the elevated command prompt. In the command prompt window, type in the command shown on the screen and press the Enter key after typing in each one. Close the command prompt and restart your PC. Method 2. Change DNS server address. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the run dialog box, type in ncpa.cpl and click OK. Right click your network adapter and select properties. Select internet protocol version 4, TCP IPv4 and click properties. Tick use the following DNS server addresses. In the preferred DNS server, type in 1.1.1.1. In the alternate DNS server, type in 1.0.0.1. Click OK. Restart your PC for the changes to take effect. Method 3. Disable the IPv6 protocol. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the run dialog box, type in ncpa.cpl and click OK. Right click your network adapter and select properties. In the networking tab, Uncheck the checkbox next to Internet Protocol version 6, TCP IPv6, and click OK. Method 4. Allow Valorant through Windows Defender Firewall. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the Run dialog box, type in firewall.cpl and click OK. Click Allow an app or feature through Windows Firewall. In the Allowed Apps and Features window, click Change Settings. Click Allow another app. Then, click Browse. Navigate to C colon backslash Riot Games backslash Riot Client. Select Riot Client Services.exe and click Open. Click Add to add Riot Client. Mark the checkboxes in the private and public columns next to Riot Client. Click Allow another app. Click Browse. Navigate to C colon backslash Riot Games backslash Valorant backslash Live. Select Valorant.exe and click Open. Click Add to add Bootstrap Packaged Game. Mark the checkboxes in the private and public columns next to Bootstrap Packaged Game. Click Allow another app. Click Browse. Navigate to C colon backslash Riot Games backslash Valorant backslash Live backslash Shooter Game backslash Binaries backslash Win64. Select Valorant Win64 Shipping and click Open. Click Add to add Valorant. Mark the checkboxes in the private and public columns next to Valorant, and click OK. Method 5. Set proxy settings to automatic. Hold down Windows plus R keys to open run. In the run dialog box, type in i, netcpl.cpl, and click OK. Select the Connections tab. 
Click LAN settings. Unmark the use of proxy server for your LAN checkbox. Mark the automatically detect settings checkbox and click OK. Method 6. Reinstall Riot Vanguard. Right click start and select apps and features. Scroll through the app list and find Riot Vanguard. Click uninstall and click uninstall again. Click yes to continue. Launch Valorant and Riot Vanguard will be reinstalled automatically. Method 7. Repair Valorant's installation. Open your browser and go to the Valorant website. Click Play Free. Click Sign In. Enter your login credentials and click Sign In. Click Download. Run install Valorant.exe once it's downloaded. Click Advanced Options and navigate to Riot Games. Make sure to select the correct destination folder, otherwise Valorant won't be repaired. Click Install. Hopefully, this video provided you with the information you were looking for. If you're using a Windows computer, we suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. Combo Cleaner's real-time anti-malware scanner will stop malware from gaining a foothold on your PC. Anti-ransomware protection will protect your most precious files against being encrypted by ransomware. Combo Cleaner's web browsing protection will block scams, malicious websites, and downloads. Also, Combo Cleaner's duplicate file finder and big files finder will help you clean up your PC and save gigabytes of valuable disk space. Don't let malware wreak havoc on your computer. Download Combo Cleaner today. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.